Key Steps in a Systematic Review, brought to you by Evidence Synthesis Ireland and Cochrane Crowd. In this module, we're going to look at asking the right question. The wise person doesn't give the right answers, they pose the right questions. When making decisions about health, it is important not to rely on the results from a single study. A systematic review aims to carefully combine the results of multiple studies investigating the same thing. A critical step in the process of producing a systematic review is making sure the question is right. Setting out with a dodgy question is like building a house on dodgy foundations. But what do we mean by asking the right question? The right question needs to be needed. Doable. Clear. And relevant. A question that is too big or too broad in scope will be hard to answer well and may take a very long time to do. Here's an example. Is exercise good for you? This question is far too broad. What kind of exercise? What does good for you mean? Is it about losing weight, improving strength, or preventing dementia? Who is the you in the question? A child? A teen? A middle-aged woman? Someone over 65? However, a question that is too narrow in scope may fail to be relevant to anyone. For example, is high-intensity rowing before breakfast good for reducing blood pressure in retired Olympic athletes? Luckily, help is at hand, thanks to the PICO framework. P stands for patient or population. I stands for intervention. C stands for comparison and O stands for outcomes. A carefully thought through PICO will set the review up on solid foundations.